the shrill voice of the shepherd woman song cuts through the silent mountain pass i'm in kashmir 4000 meters above sea level and the setting reminds me of a quote by kipling the smell of the himalayas if it once creeps into the blood of a man that man will at last forgetting all else return to the hills to die hi i'm dan and you guys are watching bag on my back My journey began in Srinagar, the valley capital of Kashmir. But I quickly moved through the pleasant countryside to reach a base camp near Pehelgaon. So, we finally reached here in Aru and this is going to be our campsite for the day. It's a completely green valley with a small river stream running side running at our sides. So, today will be a good day because we'll be sleeping with the sound of the river. and i think tomorrow is going to be the trek starting from behind me right trekking in the himalayas is an overload of emotions the physical exhaustion and the lack of any domestic comfort is a psychological hindrance but it's not always bitter fruit the view of the majestic peaks and the million starlit night sky make up for all the troubles many times over during the day the wilderness is my playground and i wander off into the hillside to reach the destination for the day being constantly on the move like this makes me appreciate the little things in life so we had a really long walk today and you uh, was just amazing and the best part is after a long days walk i'm having food there's nothing which comes close to this feel of having a food with the view after a long exhausting walk home is where the tent is pitched for the night and the sleeping bag in the cold of the night is a comfort like no other In the mountains of Kashmir live seasonal shepherds. They herd their goat here during summer so as to utilize the rich grasslands. And during this time they make these high altitudes their home, living a very hard and rugged life. Tarsar Three thousand eight hundred meters is a glacial lake. Here, the wind has a harsh chill to it. I spent a few minutes of calm, staring into the turquoise water. This is the pinnacle of the trek. What weeks of preparation! and days of walking have all come down to but then the entire trip isn't about this one moment it's about the journey of getting here 
the hardship, joy, and all that passion. Then I remember, from here lies a painful long walk to civilization, a descent back home. So behind me, our final camp is being dismantled. So our trek is almost over. We've got another uh, half an hour to one hour to walk. Quite an emotional moment. Five days of non-stop walking and we finally <coughs> going, gonna go back to civilization. I often tell people, being a traveler isn't a hobby. It's a lifestyle. So is being a son of the hills. I always leave knowing I will return again. Because I'm my true self only when I have the smell of Himalayas in my bones. A huge thank you if you watched up till here. If you like this video, please share like and hit the subscribe button below. More exciting content will be posted soon and it would mean a lot to me if you guys hit the subscribe button.